Hello YouTube and hello to all the Borderlands badasses. I'm Natanus Likens and welcome back to part three of our first look at our first playthrough, however you want to say that, of uh, Tiny Tina's Wonderlands. Uh, we left off, we just got through getting the third part of the shrine, which I don't recall what it is. I think it's like health regen or something, uh, but that's where we're at. Uh, and in this format, what we're doing is we're just doing straight up 30 minutes of gameplay. That way we got a much shorter video. I do realize that that means there's going to be probably some dead space in there where I probably could do some edits and uh, like put together something that is more entertaining. Uh, but this is supposed to be like a first interaction, these first four videos of me exploring this, seeing what it's like and uh, finding out how stuff works. Uh, so that's where we're at right now in our little playthrough. Uh, I do have a timer sitting here, and as always, there is 30 minutes set on this, and we're going to do like a 30-minute segment of just going through stuff, regardless of what happens, and exploring this game. Uh, and eventually, once this series is complete, because we only got one more 30-minute session left to do, uh, it will be something that I plan on streaming on occasion over on Twitch at twitch.tv slash Likens. I do believe that is either one word or it's Natanis underscore Likens. Either way, there should be a link on my channel for my Twitch channel. Saying channel twice there just kind of made me lose concentration. Forget what I was saying, forget what I was doing, all that. You know that. Like, talking directly to a camera and an audience is sometimes something you gotta work at. And that is what we are doing. So, uh, without further ado, I want to go into this town here first. If there's no gameplay, I'm not going to start the timer just yet. And uh, one of the dogs is barking downstairs. Lovely. Uh, I've... With that being said, I do have little Miss Dolly sitting here beside me still. For you guys, is probably about three weeks uh, of these videos coming out. For me, it's like a couple hours. So by the time you've seen this part of it, it's already been like three weeks uh, in real time. That's just because I'm going to like stagger these out and let them come out over time, basically. So, yeah, let's go ahead and see if there's stuff for me to do, like actual fights and everything. I'm going to go ahead and start the timer. But this is, if this is just a town that I'm just walking in, I'm not going to start the timer just yet because I feel like that's kind of cheap. Because there's not really a whole lot going on. You guys can't see a whole lot. And there are bigger channels out there that do playthroughs and they do major edits. Yeah, good thing that caravan's not ominous might be scared otherwise that fortune teller looks awfully demonic which is both unfortunate and yeah, ghost here. if you ask me this okay so this is dlc Again? stuff we don't want to be here you've traveled such a long way to be here that is a cool looking avatar up there on the top right that is really cool i, I like that i think it would hurt until you said that i can tell you're an expert that must be the Far beyond bright the reclaim thing that I've heard about. What is this? That's storage. Is there anything for me to get out? Because I do have. Nope. Okay. your aura is radiant. It's top notch. I won't lie. But I see a great cloud hovering over you. Oh, does the cloud rain money? I don't want to do that. It's skepticism. A cloud of skepticism. You doubt my ability to read your fate. Yes, yeah, so these are all the mirrors. Oh, here we go. We got vendors. Now, fortune I have for you, I know what you like. I see a great partnership in your future. If that's the fate you choose to make. What kind of partnership? A couple of different weapons here. And fortunes tell. The only limit to your fortune. What in the world is that? That looks so weird. Um, I'm not gonna worry about that. Let's just go ahead and. Sell all these. Okay, 
Okay, give me all that. Apparently we got white bone. Wait, white widget. Anyway, white metal. Uh, I'm guessing that's a coloration. Uh, makeup color pack. I don't know what that is. What we got here? So that's a new spell. Calamity, calamity, yeah. Not too worried about those. What we got here? This is our wards. With a little plate, you won't be late. 13% resistance. Ward recharged away. Sorry, I got a notification on my watch. So I had to look down. Okay. Uh, I don't see anything really worth buying over there. Oh, we got hairstyles. I didn't see these hairstyles before. I can go with the caped look. Okay, so we got hairstyles. Whoops. Uh, I don't remember what we had here. I think we just had the basic. Uh, eye color. Yeah, we we did that to get the uh, the whole night elf look from World Warcraft. That's all I see there. Face, woo. Okay, so we got a new scar set up. Okay, so the scars are on the lips. New tattoo. Eh. Not gonna worry about that. Tattoo colors. We got new colors for the tattoos. I don't know why I'm looking at this without a tattoo. <laughs> Eyeliner. Okay, I don't see any difference there. Eyeliner color, we're definitely not going to see that. Eyeshadow. Okay, so I do see the, where the marks are here. That's interesting. Eyeshadow color, blush, blush color, lipstick, lipstick color, not something I care about. Armor pattern. Do I actually have to select it to see it? Oh, that's interesting. So we do have that going on. Okay, primary colors. We got new color combos. I'm failing to see where this is being applied, though. <laughs> See, this is kind of obvious. This, not so much. Like, I, I don't see where it's getting applied at. And probably because of our armor type. Because so we don't have any actual armor just yet. Okay, so this I can clearly see. This is way more obvious. Ooh. Yeah, we're just going to leave that. Um, okay, so that's that upper piece there. I can clearly see that. we got kind of a white look. Kind of a gray look. I'm guessing it's supposed to be like a gold look or something. We may go ahead and select that. Um, face decorations? Yeah, we already looked through those. 
Oh, can we just change? Interesting. Oh, wait. Yeah, I wanted to look at... So, emotes... I did not know we had all other emotes we could get. So we can put those there. Okay. Banner. We got new banner stuff we can look at. Uh, I don't think we had the option to look at our banner earlier. Obviously, I have not ch uh, started the timer because we are messing around with stuff that isn't really in-game. Do that. Okay, so that's the background of the banner. I am not doing pink. Uh, let's go with this. Okay, so that's... We just click on the same thing? Oh, here we go. We got emblems. Dragon Lord. Butt Stallion. Some kind of archer. That's an arrow. I think that's the default one. A couple of pistols. An eye with wings. Some kind of phoenix. I like that. Then we got this here. We're definitely going with red. Banner presets. Yeah, and I do like that gold look there, so we're going to keep that. I do like this kind of shredded thing, especially considering we're using the the, uh, the grave. Uh, statue, I don't know what this is. Diamond, yes, diamond. <laughs> Valorous, yes, <laughs> we're, we're doing that. I'm not sure what this statue is for. Uh, I got a feeling that statue is for when we beat the game. Okay, yep. That's oh, that. Yeah, I definitely made the right choice. Yep, yep, what we did. Uh, this feels like this This is going to be like in-game content. Uh, as of right now, I don't see a reason to do this. So we are going to back on this. Uh, I don't actually know where the exit is. There, there may be a good reason for us to go ahead and do that. I don't know. But we're going to skip it for now. I don't see much of a reason in doing that. All right. So reach right both. Uh, let's go ahead, start our timer up after that. And uh, there's our 30 minutes started. You know, that seemed like a little bit of extra that was going on there. I don't see anything here. Queen's Gate. Let's see what this is. I got a feeling this is another encounter area. Like, we're going to have to do some fighting and things. But I'm not entirely sure. We're just going to have to see what happens. Now, one thing I think I am going to do is I'm going to, for videos and for uh, streaming, I think we'll keep this character for that, but I'm going to go and make another character just to play around with. Hey, I know I'm the villain, but I still just wanted to wish you luck on the whole quest thing. Maybe. luck, right? I mean, you're the fate maker. Yes, we are the fate maker. Sorry, I had to pay attention to that. Um, yeah, so that's one of those things where I, I just, I want to be able to actually play this and not be concerned about whether or not I'm re whether or not I'm recording. Yes, please. Give me that. Yes, yes, yes. That's going to be so much better for us. I was not expecting to find something uh, purple that soon. 
showers, sickle of showers. Uh, cast around the owner. Uh, damage reduction increase, spell radius decrease, attaches to caster. So this is something that stays with us. Not too worried about that. This is a cast and forget. So this is a meteor. Uh, this is potentially better than the one we currently have. Okay, 75 damage, 29.3 cooldown. No. Uh, 95 damage? And that says 75. I wonder if that's because it's currently equipped to us, so it's showing a higher percent increase. I'm not entirely sure. I don't see anything here worth it, so we're going to get off of that. Uh, we do need a better ward. Shock resist. Hundred and seventeen capacity. That might be really good. I don't know. What is our current ward at? It's at ninety. Oh, this has increased movement when it depletes. But it's only got seventy three capacity. And knock back all enemies on ward break. Uh, I'm not too concerned with that. Yeah, at this stage, I don't really feel like spending any kind of stuff for just simple upgrades is a big problem. So we are going to go ahead and do that. Uh, so that has ward regeneration rate of 15. This is delay of negative 25%. So this will recharge sooner, but that one would have recharged faster. I'm not going to worry too much about that. Let's just go ahead and sell those. Uh, I don't know when we get... I don't know what that is. I don't know what that slot is. I'm not gonna worry about it. More gold. There's a fork in the road. Before you rise the mighty walls of Great Hook. But you're not the only new arrival. A massive skeleton army is sieging the city! Oh gosh. <laughs> so there's a lot going on. Can we join our ranks soon enough? Yeah. Skelly ships land unloading evil cargo of skelly men and skelly women. Okay, yeah. We 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 got it, Tina. There's a lot of skeletons. And I'm noticing our weapons are already kind of uh, useless. Am I getting hit? Fight for a life already. That 
That voice sounded like... What is hitting me? Ollie, was that you? I could have sworn I just heard Ollie's voice. Oh gosh. Goodbye. <laughs> I thought Ollie was a Minecrafter. What is he doing voicing a character here? Okay, I don't think I'm supposed to go near the ships. When do I actually get my uh, companion? That's part of the reason why I chose this class. I thought it was just part of it. Oh, hi. Ooh. Whoa, what just happened? Oh, wow, the game crashed. All right, we're back. Uh, I don't know what just happened. The game completely crashed on me. Um, I want to see... Is there anything we can do about this texture, stream material, shadows, medium, let's make it low, because we, we keep getting, like, frame lag. I want to set some of this stuff down lower than what it is currently at. Especially shadows. Uh, material, probably keep. I do apologize for that. That was weird. I don't know why I did that. I have no idea why it crashed. Alright, so we are going to level up real quick, apparently. Because I've got a level. I have a hero point. Um, uh, we're just going to drop it into the spell status effect because we are using ice at the moment at some point we will be using something else uh, i don't know why it, the game crashed though that was uh, <laughs> unexpected i was not expecting that oh i did see that right there all right so it looks like we're gonna have to go through and start fighting these guys all over again I do want to see... Yeah, that's a lot more damage, apparently. Wait, he's on fire too? Oh, it's because the barrel blew up beside him. Nice. That's already down. That's a new order item or something. Hopefully this doesn't crash us this time. <laughs> I still don't know what happened there. I don't know why it crashed. Oh my gosh, we just took a massive hit. We definitely need some health. I thought you were dead. I see those guys coming in. I know we were getting ready to take on some kind of armored skeleton, something sitting me. Yeah, him. Oh, 
Papa, he's gone. So I'm guessing this is the barrier and I need to go in here. Is there anything for me to get? Apparently not. I still hear Butt Stallion. You see a lone figure fighting back against the endless tide of skelly beds. Oh. Though his armor is scarred by a hundred battles, his I, honor is untarnished. I think most people would be annoyed by this, but as this is essentially D and D, I love it. This is awesome. Uh I can't make that out at all. I wonder if that's because I turned down the textures. We may have to turn that back up. That voice sounds familiar. That sounds like the little boy from a uh, prequel. The pre-sequel, that is. Hang on, let's... <laughs> I wasn't expecting something there to be really low quality. Fog is fine. Turn the foliage down is fine. Cluster is fine. Display stats off. Shadows low. That's fine. Graphics quality low. Yeah, we we aren't getting any frame lag now, so we may have to just so deal that, deal with it. Quite the mouth on you, for a paladin. Do I bloody look like I've got time for manners lessons? I'm up to my card piece and I'm dead. <laughs> they came out of nowhere. Yeah, that's the dragon lord's doing. Just yep. came from Robiner's tomb, actually. The Dragon Lord! Bollocks, we'll have to deal with him later. Right now, we have to break this siege. Yeah, we do. Undead so, quit talking and let me through. I need you to destroy them. Here, yeah, we'll, we'll destroy them. Just See, let us through. I know you like explosives, but can you make it more fantasy thing than C4? Right, 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 right. Good catch, yeah. Uh, yeah, right, uh... Here, take this, uh, Fantasy 4. Fantasy 4? The villagers get to I don't know what that is. <laughs> it looked like a pile of meat. Fantasy 4. <laughs> so it's just some kind of weird... Okay, it's just gonna let us straight through. I see something right here. Oh, it's a door of some sort. Or a chest, not a door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really missed this part. Been too long since I conquered anything. After a few centuries, you just you get that conquering itch again, you know. Okay. Oh, you really thought we were going to win, didn't you? Extinction event? Okay. Nothing over here. Oh, hi. <laughs> Oh, what is that? What is that? There's something big up there, like an ogre or something. Can't believe I have to oh. reread the spellbook every time. Ow. Ah, <laughs> uh, something over there. Luckily for us, this frost weapon is doing us really good at the moment. What is shooting me? Oh gosh. Hey you. Did that just say Rick 
troll. Are you kidding me? Rock troll. Okay, so I'm trolling myself there. set it off or do I need to just stand very far back hey that looks like something that's what I was talking about like finding special chests hidden around um, a sniper rifle and it looks like god this thing looks amazing actually but it looks like this is a, uh, a Hyperion thing Okay, so how do I set off the C4? Okay, I'm standing very far back. Um, do I need to shoot it or something? Yeah, I need to shoot it. Much better. Now we're starting to find some things. Okay, uh. I don't know what this is. That's for a spell shot, though. We're not a spell shot. Um, that's some kind of, uh. Assault rifle? Assault crossbow thing? Um. More damage for each crossbow bolt stuck in more melee damage. So this is... Swaps between full automatically and four shot burst. And this has critical... Uh, I feel like this because we can swap between full auto and things. Ooh, this... Yeah, I like how this looks. Uh, I don't want full auto. Yes, this is this is starting to shape up as far as weaponry. Uh, I w I really wish we had our other slot. And you know what? It just dawned on me. I didn't restart the timer after our crash. So now I'm going to start it. This video is going to be a little bit longer. I do apologize. That uh, crash was not planned. Just completely and utterly random. Hopefully we don't have that problem again. We got a level up. So, yeah, we're just going to keep doing this. We don't have any dark magic yet. Uh, I am forward thinking on that and hoping we get that. I don't know why we can't unlock this shit. Like, maybe I have to spend a point on that. Maybe I don't. I don't know. Okay, so I feel like putting more wisdom is probably the thing we want to do there. So, yep. We're going to do that. I don't know why this is locked. I really want our companion. Yeah, so that's where we're at with that. It's uh, We don't have our companion yet. Of course, we don't really have... Here, let's test this thing. Uh, 
This is pretty good. I like this. Where are you at? I hear you. I don't know what that is. Your uh, staff is freaking out a little bit there. Oops. Probably should switch to you because this worked really good on the last troll. Well, I bet the reload on this thing kind of sucks. Oh, what the heck? Here, eat that. So that melee weapon is very, very, very slow. <laughs> Hi. Alright, another one of these. Is there any more? That's way too big of a jump. What if we undestroyed that last catapult and threw ourselves over? Hey, 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 hey. Don't touch the miniatures! Uh, nope. Launching yourself with a catapult sounds cool, so I'm gonna let it go this once! So I, I see that look die over there. That's what we're trying to get to at the moment. Ooh, we are hurting. Something green just fell out of you. Okay, health potion. We definitely need that. I don't know what this is. Gun damage, spore warden power. We've, we're not a spore warden. Is that what, uh. Yep, that's what that slot is. So it's like a class mod slot. And unfortunately, we don't have anything yet for the Graveborn. I need to get that luck die before I forget about it. We're definitely finding a lot of gold. I got a feeling gold's gonna be a pretty big part later on. What you got for me? You got anything good? Spell shot. We're not a spell shot. Spore warden. We're not a spore warden. Come on. Grief. We're graveborn. Give us something for a graveborn. Right, more stuff there. Is there any? We need more health. Gold. Something over here. Uh, cruddy weapon, more gold, ammo, don't see anything here. I am definitely enjoying this. This is this is really cool. <laughs> definitely a big fan. Wait, purple. Oh, that's our our sword that we currently have equipped. 
gold. I didn't really find any ammo. I'm also looking around to see if we can find another luck die. We're, we're kind of having a little bit of bad luck on certain things. Like, we're getting uh, class mods for classes that we're not playing. So that's quite annoying. Oh, there's some health. That's, that's better. Then I had a great idea. Old Stink Blossom should be a thief. Should be a thief, huh? More gold. I don't see any other really cool chests. Wait, wasn't there... I remember seeing another luck die somewhere. I do recall seeing one on a bridge that we could not access. There's a couple of chests tucked away back here. And again, the whole reason I'm looking for those at the moment, even though this is like our first playthrough, we really want to get through the game and experience it and like really put out there what we actually think about this. At the same time, the luck die is going to give us better chances at finding gear, which uh, is going to be very important. But what I'm feeling right now is I don't feel like wasting too much time because, you know, you guys are here for a very short amount of time to watch videos and just see my reaction, see the play and everything. Um, it's not like we're streaming this. If we were streaming this, we would uh, definitely go through, do a lot more looking around. Um, but in this kind of video format, I don't want to bore you guys to death with me running around doing nothing. So, we're just going to move on. I do believe we got to go to this catapult. Ooh, excuse me. And uh, launch ourselves over to the other catapult. How do I get into the catapult? Okay. <laughs> that was cool. Those catapults <laughs> take hundreds of goblin hours to construct. I'm out here creating jobs, you know. Sounds like a stand-up guy, even though he's not a stand-up guy. Trust me, friend. You don't want to stick around. There it is. Okay, shields broke. Our, our ward broke. Yep, yep, we're taking a lot of damage here. See you. Hi. Really? Good, we got him. I was sitting there thinking we probably need to use our spell on him. And then we didn't. <laughs> is there anything of value? Yes, there is. I see it. Haha! -ha. Come on, give me, give me a decent, give me a decent graveborn. Yes. Uh, more max shield. That's actually a weapon that has higher damage. 
Uh, the sword also has higher damage. Take that one. Though this one does have higher damage. It's an axe, though. I don't like axes. E even if it has higher weapon damage. I, I'm, I'm picky about that. I'd rather have a sword than an axe. Oh, there is a section up here. Is there anything for me to get up here? Doesn't look like it. I can't quite see what that is. And I don't think we can jump up here. Oh, we can. Being a thief is great! Way better than being a peasant! Stealing's a bit like working. Only you take what you like, and you oh, chess. Nice. What do you got for me? And I am dictating this is my last words before meeting the hoodsman's axe. And sure, I suppose I did piss my life away. Um, move speed increase. This does have a higher value as far as the ward. We're gonna go ahead and equip that. We got a crossbow pistol here. No special element. This has corrosive. Has higher damage. Uh, has rockets saw blade oh this isn't a crossbow what the heck is this I don't know uh slow it has higher damage we're gonna go ahead and use that because I got a film we're gonna need something with uh, corrosive damage so right now we got our ice damage and we got corrosive damage so that's good uh I do recall that we picked up a couple of Nope, we already got this one. You can get rid of that. Save some uh, utility slots. I want to know when you get your next... Uh, your next armor slot. Are you, armor slot? Your next weapon slot. Okay, so we already have that. We don't need it. And that's not a decent item. What do we look like now? Because we did put a new a new armor thing on. I can't move move around the character. So our armor does look slightly different. That's cool. Alright, let's move on. We got about seven minutes it looks like, so we can get a little bit more done. Oh god. Done. Nope. Ooh. That hurt. <laughs> Keep hitting the wrong button. <laughs> At least this combat is kind of engaging and different. I mean, it's still very much Borderlands. Like, you got enemies charging you, you got enemies attacking you from range, but the, uh, the differences are, like, all the different types. Like, we're getting hit by spellcasters, we're getting hit by archers, we got uh, a bunch of melee guys coming in our faces, and things like that. Ooh. Nine damage. It's a shotgun, too. Yeah. 
don't really care. Um, that is a much better ward. Yes, we are equipping that right off the bat. This is a Graveborn. Companion crit. Like, we don't... I don't have our companion. I don't know why we don't have our companion yet. So that would be good if we had our companion. We don't. Uh, this is area damage, so yeah. We're going to stick with that. I am going to grab this, though. Probably grab the red slows so that we can sell them at some point. I feel like we should look around a little bit. I definitely feel like there could be something else hidden somewhere. Uh, that's another axe. I don't really care about the axe. That's a battle axe, so it's not like the the funky, like butcher type axe that we've been seeing. I see that. Lucky you. Yeah. Okay. We got a, another sword there. Um, max ward capacity, that is probably actually going to be slightly better for us, especially this early, because we don't have a whole lot of health, we don't have a whole lot of ward stuff, and uh, various other bits and bobs like that. Yeah, okay, let's get back. More gold. More ammo. Okay. I do love how this looks. Like, this... Can, can we take a second to appreciate the artwork in here? Because this looks amazing. And some of the weapons that we've come across, too, I have been... Even the little bit that we have played now, because this is part three, we're about an hour and 30 minutes into it. Um, the art in this is just absolutely amazing. I love how everything looks. This definitely feels like a more fantasy type uh, game setting, even though all of these weapons are clearly guns. But they've done it in such a way that they look like crossbows and such. Uh, this one, not so much. This definitely looks like a gun. But uh, some of these are just... I, I've been blown away by how well they look. And I also... I love the inclusion of melee weapons. Um, what little bit I've played of Borderlands 3... I did notice right away that they did not also do melee weapons in that. I'm kind of disappointed in that. You still have just your standard bash attack. Um, so the inclusion of melee weapons in this... I think it's phenomenal. I love that concept. I love how this is so far. And I really wish that for Borderlands 4, if they are making a Borderlands 4, I really wish they would include that. Um, it's still pretty early. We're still very early on in this game. And uh, I'm very, very impressed with it so far. Again, I don't know why people hate it on this. Uh, we did have some issues early on, so I definitely had to tone down the graphics a little bit. Uh, beyond that character page intro, I haven't noticed any kind of major issue with that. So uh, yeah, this is, this is really good. I'm enjoying it. Um, with that being said, we are going to go ahead and end this one, even though we are a few seconds ahead of that the timer is going to getting ready to go off here in a few seconds so uh yeah if you guys are enjoying this please leave a like and if you're loving what i'm doing here on youtube with my channel and the variety of content i provide uh think about subscribing i would much appreciate it and until the next one guys take care and goodbye